Yeah, we're Anka Davis. Bill Flower. Minister, I wonder if you'd join me in paying tribute to the work that's been done through the pandemic with some brilliant local organisations like Bridge End County Care and Repair. Despite the constraints and restrictions of the pandemic, they carried on trying to do those adaptations throughout my area. But also, would she agree with me that this is more than that as well? It's about things like the Comtaf Stay Well at Home service, which we funded several years ago through ICT funding, bringing together Rhonda Cannon Taft, Merthyr, Comtaf University Health Board, with a service that brings together social workers, therapists, physiotherapists, therapy technicians, uh, in order that people, rather than go into hospital and stay in hospital, can be rapidly discharged and then live at home and recuperate at home where they want to be. So I just ask, Minister, will you recognise the amazing work that's gone on through this pandemic, even with the, the additional constraints that they faced, uh, and just join me in thanking them for what they've been doing? Oh, absolutely, uh, Hugh Aranka Davis. I would very much like to join with you in thanking everyone who, despite all the challenges you've outlined, have worked to ensure that those who need them continue to get the adaptations they need to live safely, avoid hospital admission, and make a timely return home. Um, you know as well as I do that the Princess of Wales, Royal Glamorgan and Prince Charles Hospitals all participate in the Hospital to a Healthier Home Scheme in partnership with Bridge and Comtaf Care and Repair Agencies. Um, I'd just uh, I'd like to tell you that in the 10 months to the end of January, 739 patients received an adaptation that assisted their safe discharge, uh, saving over 4,500 bed days. Uh, 86 of those patients were helped to access additional benefits as well with an annual value of around £420,000. So you're absolutely right. Uh, the working together of the various agencies has resulted not only in safer, quicker discharges, but the uh, additional income and support for people who need that support to be able to live a happy, healthy life at home.